So we have another bond which pays semi-annual coupon. So the face value of the bond is 1000. 1000. Issue date is 18 September 2012. Maturity date is 17 September 18. Settlement date is 6-7-2013. Coupon is 12.75% per annum. Number of coupons per year is 2 which means it's a semi-annual bond. Dirty price is 1004.94. <coughs> now let's find out how many days have passed in the hotel. Settlement happens on 6-7-2013. Maturity is on 17 September 18. Frequency is the number of coupons per year which is 2. Basis is actual by actual. So we get 111 days. So the total days in the coupon period will be given by coup days. Again, settlement is the date of purchase of bond. Maturity is on 17 September 18. Frequency is the number of coupons per year. And basis is actual by actual, which is 184 days. So which means 111 by 184, 60% of the days in the coupon period have already passed at the time this bond was sold. Total coupon for the year for the period will be face value into annual coupon rate divided by number of coupons per year 2. So for each half year, the bond will give a coupon of 63.75. 63.75 into 60% is a coupon that is that the seller of the bond is entitled on the day of selling that is 6-7-2013. So the clean price of the bond is the minus the coupon that is that the seller is entitled for. So the clean price is only 966. To calculate the yield maturity 17 September 2018 rate is 12.75 price of 100 rupee bond is 966 divided by 10 redemption will happen at 1000 divided by 10 because where are we doing this excel can handle only 100 rupee face value bond so we are converting this 1000 into 100 and base is actually at 1 I think we missed something Again, let's try yield settlement maturity rate price redemption will happen at 100 frequency is 2 and basis is 1 so we get 13.66% as the yield of this semi-annual bond.